How's it going everybody? My name is Sessler and right now we are here on the bottom fields of SIT where the Wednesday night soccer league takes place. Right now we're at the tournament which is uh, at the height of the uh, summer because we have the most light and we have a bunch of different teams uh, and a lot of goals today and hopefully we'll have a good champion. But the most important thing is that people are having fun and I want to know why people are having fun so let's let's come and check this out because this is this is really good, really good soccer. So let's let's check it out. You are one of the organizers of this event. Yeah, we did. This is the 11th season. And um, before this, I coached the, the young girls, the Storm girls. And they're all going to high school. And we always played seven aside. And I think seven aside is a really cool game. And uh, I said, now we do always something for the youth. Let's do something for the adults. Mm -hmm. So we, uh, we continued doing this for adults. We started with uh, eight teams, two fields. And uh, we added uh, one field to it, so we have three fields. And uh, at a given night, uh, we have 12 teams playing soccer here. And it's, uh, it's very informal, uh, there's no referees. We have certain, uh, certain rules for, for, the, for the game. It's all about fun. Uh, and there is like four teams on the waiting list. Uh, they want to. They want. They want to play, and uh, we just don't have more. Don't have. Don't, don't have more. More room for them. It's just a fun thing. And why do you like coming out here? What, what is. What is it that you enjoy so much around here? Well, I'm not exactly sure how we did it, but we just hit the right balance between having something that was formal but not too formal. Uh, we don't have referees for instance uh, which I think is great in a lot of ways because people behave themselves and they call their own fouls and you know it keeps things friendly. Um, people are take it seriously but not too seriously. Um, that you know it's not all about winning it's it's about having fun uh, but there's enough formality to it that people you know have a uniform and you know take it seriously enough so that everyone everyone has a good time the rules are actually there's a few rules um, again it's a it's a small sided game it's uh, 55 yards long 44 yards wide it's pretty much half a soccer field playing across and they do this a lot in Europe too there's no offside rules there is kick-ins, so no throw-ins. Uh, there is no referee, so and then the team, the team that's behind, can make a call. So if there's like a dispute about a call, the team that's behind gets the gets the gets the call. Um, no penalty kicks, and um, and we all know that we have to go back to work the next day and uh, respect each other. There's also you see on the both sides there's a lot of wood. There is streams on both sides, there's a few bridges, but sometimes, you know, players kick the ball so hard that it disappears into the, into the forest with lots of ticks and all kinds of little creatures out there. And the rule is that everybody who kicks the ball over the goal has to pick it up, has to find it. And uh, that can sometimes take like five to ten minutes and that teach people just to hit the target, isn't it? Get it low. <laughs> Get it, keep, it, keep it low. So that's a fun rule too. <coughs> that's pretty much the rules and uh, it's, a, it's a very inexpensive event uh, where all, uh, each team pays uh, $325 for the season. And, uh, and uh, that goes a little bit to use of the fields and like today in the tournament we have uh, food for everyone, something to buy, teams, a ball. Um, and it, it starts the first first uh, uh, weekend in uh, in May, the uh, first Wednesday in May till the last Wednesday in August. So it's a pretty long season. It's cool. So we're here with a really legendary player here in the fields. How you doing, Prague? I'm doing good, man. How are you? Doing well. So uh, what do you think about this uh, league right here? Oh, this league is fabulous. This is um, you know something so organic starting here in Bradboro a few years back. And it's been really great for a lot of players who want to continue playing, you know, including myself. So it's been a blessing. So I really love it. I enjoyed it a lot. I look forward to this thing every, every summer. So how long have you been at this league? 
Uh, since the beginning, but even before that, there was pickup. Um, yeah. Probably I've been playing here for 20 years, and um, for a long time it was just pickup, and it was just all one big game. And the rule was women over 25 and men over 35. <laughs> so um, it's, changed, it's changed a little since. It's then. changed, and it's wonderful. I mean, there's so many cool things about coming out here. One of my favorite things is just seeing all different kinds of people and even hearing different languages spoken. It just makes me so happy in little old Brattleboro, you know? Mm -hmm. But also that it's co-ed and it seems like a good combination of a chill attitude but some pretty skilled play. Mm -hmm. um, and there's a lot of places where people have a little too much of an ego that I've played in the past, but mm -hmm. it doesn't seem to be the case here. So. How was your first game? It was great. It was very evenly matched, great team, Brat Pack. We always have fun playing them. So you say you've been coming out for like 30 years to these games? About 37 years on this field at different leagues. And then I think it's been like seven or eight years, maybe a little longer on this seven on seven. Before it was a 11 on 11. So what is so special about coming down like in this uh, league? Uh, the, the camaraderie, you know, the teams. Everybody's been coming for years and they bring new blood in. It makes it very competitive for, for us old guys. It's, you know, it's a little difficult to keep up with them, but it's just a great league, a lot of fun. What, what, uh, how long have you guys played together? Uh, this is what, our fourth year together, I think? Fourth or fifth. And yeah, we've enjoyed playing here. It's a nice little field when it's not wet. Um, it's, we've kind of played each other in high school and all the way up through, so we just got a team together and came down. It's a lot of fun. Cool. How about you, man? What do you like about coming out here? Uh, just like playing soccer, getting out, getting some touches on the ball, yeah. scoring some goals. Yeah, that's about it. <laughs> who's the Who's the top uh, scorer here? I don't think we have a top scorer. Yeah. Like we, 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 spread spread we spread around quite a bit. You yeah. know, <laughs> we make some full field runs. Sometimes some defenders score. You know. Um, yeah. So I have a uh, important question: Who's gonna win the tournament today? Oh, we are. We are. Probably, I think it's our fourth straight if we win. What's fourth? All right, so we're with the champions right here. One, two, three. Foot Steelers. This is your first time coming out here. Yeah, it's my first time. Yeah. What do you think about it? I like it. It's you know, um, I, I love the people and um, it's pretty diverse. And yeah, I like I, I, I like playing soccer. And yeah, that's why I'm here. Are you gonna come back here? Yeah, I'm gonna come back definitely. Yeah. <laughs> this guy's really good player. I play with him on Sundays. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he's he's a pretty solid player. So watch out for this guy. This is this is danger, danger in the box. Thank you, man. So how are you doing, Ron? Good, good. Just had a good game. We yeah, lost, but we had a good game. Yeah, what was the score? It was three nil. Unfortunately. Well, it happens sometimes. It happens. Yes. Yep. So how long have you been coming out for this uh, this league? Uh, I think I've been out here about six or eight years, somewhere about that. Yeah. Yep. And what, what do you like coming out here? What, what is one thing I that you like? I love the, just the spirit of everything. Everybody's having a good time. You know, we all play fairly. It's a, it's a good feeling, you know, good people, you know, good sportsmanship, lots of fun, hard play, lots of excitement, you know, good exercise. It, it's, it's, it's everything you would want, yeah. And on top of coming out here, you're also a coach, correct? I am. What, what, what do you coach? Well, I coach middle school and U14 <laughs> club teams, girls. So have you seen some of your players come out and play as well here? Yes. As a matter of fact, my two daughters are playing with me who are alumni of my both my middle school and my club team. And they're and one's out of college. They both played in school. And so they're here playing tonight too. But I, we get players that, that have been through. I mean, Natasha's playing out here. She's a past player of mine, this type of thing. So it's a lot of fun. Yeah. It's a lot of family here. Uh, yes, so soccer family and real family too. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the tournament's really good. Uh, we played really good teams today. Good, like these teams have really good sportsmanship, and they're actually a lot of fun to play with. Very nice. We um, played that gray shirt team, and they're just amazing passers. And last week I played them, and I got really frustrated. But this week they were. It was like a lot of fun. I started my senior year of high school, and now I'm a junior, so like three to four years here. Nice. Yeah, and this actually may be my last year. I know, I know. <laughs> what is your first uh, imp impression of this tournament? My impression, um, it's it just seems like laid back fun. Like I see a lot of families out here, surprisingly, um, like all ages, all um, ethnicities. Oh, look, we have the ball right here. Game ball. Um, all uh, skill levels, and it like you know, it's like there's a healthy comp competition, but like at the same time, everyone's just really just all here to have fun. It's not you know, no one's 
freaking out and yeah I mean I maybe I was freaking out a little bit I'm a little intense but I was also out of shape but it was also a lot of fun I really loved the game so yeah she's joining uh, my team today so yeah. hopefully we'll become the champions today yeah I mean 3-3 three, three, I we you know came out like we at the very end like I was really you played amazing uh, thank you almost a hat trick two goals right yeah so very very impressive um and uh the team we played was really good too. So you know, it's also like a surprisingly, like, good players like mixed in. I was actually very impressed. What I like is just a little bit of camaraderie. You know, we get to know each other, uh, we cheer each other on. Uh, again, what I like is that it's a game of soccer, but as soon uh, you put a referee in between game, it gets a little more intense. And without a referee, I think everybody, you know, it it, it doesn't matter so much. The, we don't never keep score. You keep score a little bit, but it doesn't matter. There's no competition. You cannot get relegated. You cannot get promoted. It's just come out here and play soccer and and stay active and have fun and play the ball and play with with with, with your friends. And it's also co-ed, what I think is cool. Multi-generational uh, too. Multi generation We have it's a uh, minimum age of 16 years, and I think the oldest and that might be me by now, <laughs> uh, 57. I think Ron is 58, so it's uh, it's it's quite some age difference. Yeah. I hope we can just do this for many years to come, and uh, and we haven't had any team yet that said I do I won't come anymore. I mean, they, they like it here, so we keep going as long as we can. Yeah, and the nice thing is also we can decide if it's uh, we cancel or not. So the fields are it's pretty much in uh, unless the rain is pretty swampy, but even with puddles, as you know, we play in puddles as well. So yeah, it's good. good. And it's a nice place for the for the kids as well. You know, there's a pond out there, and there's snapping turtles and fish, and so parents bring also their uh, or players bring the kids with them, and, uh, and again have a good time here. Yeah, as long as the bugs are not there. <laughs> yeah.